Well, one of the big concepts is, is future-proofing. What's happening with technology? How is that shifting the types of assets that we're investing in? And are we moving from you know, wind and solar into energy storage, for example? But it also changes the way we look at roads, if you want to think about the long-term trends on autonomous vehicles. It changes the way we look at water treatment in terms of distributed water treatment technologies. And so it's very interesting to see what technology can play on core and essential infrastructure and how we should be really thinking about that in terms of protecting our returns, but also maximizing the value-added opportunities that we can bring to investors.